Good morning and welcome to Batley's Pond. It's a bit different than last week, it's very windy. There's quite a few people fishing. Five on the pond already, so. Hopefully I'll have some success, but if I don't, well, it's very different conditions, so you can't always plan what's going to happen because the weather can change those plans. Well, first put in. I've got a nice fish, does not want in. It's a touch. It's a decent sized one. Oh, yeah, I suddenly realised it's hooked. Yeah, this did not know it was hooked. This is a nice fish. If this is a tench, it's, uh, it's one of the better ones I've had out of here. Because it could be a leather carp, or a mirror carp, that I just haven't seen the other scales on. It's a carp, that's why. into that corner and we've got plenty of food down there and there's tench bubbles around every now and then. I'm quite hopeful that won't be the last fish but I've got it wrong before. Oh, floats back up. The meat is what I had the carp on, but it's not getting bites as quick. But then I'm not hitting the muscles, so I'm there. I'd rather actually catch fish than just see they're getting bites. No, well, keep fishing. I'm sure we'll get something else. Now we've got something on the muscle. We don't want in. Okay, fish. Not as big as the last one, not as big as the carp, but it certainly doesn't want to. Oh, that's why it feels heavy. It's got something big with it. A lot of weed. Oh. But there is a fish in there. And it's not a small fish, it's a tetch. Hey! A lot bigger than it was because of all that weed. All right, put it down. And we'll get that sorted. There we go, a nice tench, just about a pound. Get that bite. I've just cast in with some fresh meat on and got a bite straight away. So, don't want to leave the baits too long. It's possibly one of the things I need to think about. Fresh bait, nice and oily, etc. So I'm getting bites on the muscle, but missing them. Um, yeah, nothing like last week, couldn't do anything wrong. A bit more hard work this week. Really make sure you enjoy the days when it all goes well. So it's bread on there now instead of muscle. And it's just settling. Finally hooked something again. Doesn't want to come in, which is always a good sign. Mm -hmm. 
getting near. Ah, it's got a lot of weed with it as well. Probably explain some of the weight. Here's the tench. Yeah, looks like a tench. Right, it's like a tench, and is a tench. Fantastic. There we go. That was uh, our muscle. again. Another one in. Not that big. It might be another tench actually. Oh no. A bit more carpy than that. This might be a crucian or a, an F1, but we'll get it in. go love the crucian probably a pound in weight nice fish well, that one was on muscle again giving up with the meat for now just fishing a piece of muscle size 20 hook and we're getting the bites we've got another fish Uh, nice roach or mussel. I don't think I've had mussel, um, roach or mussel before actually. Well, the mussel's starting to pay dividends. It's a uh, small carp, common. Seems to be working well. So this morning I set off without any food. Um, food didn't show properly, I was half asleep. Lost some gear out the back, um, a tray. But anyway, I'm here and someone's cooking sausage sandwiches on the lake. Which would be lovely if I was having one. But I'm on a diet at the moment, so I can't. Now we have a nice perch on the muscle. It's a good bait, good all round bait. It works really well in this pond, but there's a lot of natural swan mussel in here. Um, I'll get this one back, try again. I can smell sausage sandwich floating up the lake, and I'm not eating for an hour or two. Uh oh dear. Well, the wind's really picked up. I don't know how long I'm going to be staying because it's uh, more than just a little bit blowy now. And uh, yeah, it's not that much fun. I'm still getting bites on the uh, mussel. Get the odd fish, I've had a few roach, nothing decent. Uh, so I may stick on bread, I'll have a go on that. I haven't got that much long le longer left. My wedding anniversary today, so I'm going to go and spend some time with my lady. So, uh, yeah, just see how it goes. Well, I'm getting towards the ends now. Oh, we've got a crucian in there. Perfect. Get this one back. See if we can get another big one. I've put a big bait on the other rod and just going to see what happens. And we're in again. Not sure what it is yet. Doesn't want to come in. Which is always a good sign. Oh, I think it's a crucian. Hoping it's a crucian. I love a crucian. Yep, it's a crucian. And this is on the uh, muscle. Oh. Right, this one's fighting. I've only got a small hook on, so I'll try and take it easy. Oh, 
that's a nice fish. Let's see if we can get it in. Brought a lot of weed with it. It's a carp. I think it is. Not 100% sure. Looks very carpy. Oh, is it a chub? I think it might be a nice chub. I think it might be a decent chub, actually. Get that one in and see what we've got. Old rubber lips. Good three pound on that one. Anyway, we'll uh, get it off and have a look at it. Lovely chub. Yeah, two and a half, three pounds, comfortably. Nice fish. We'll get it back. Here we go. I think this is a roach, not a chub. In which case, it's a very nice roach. Caught on the mussel again. And I said I'd not had them on mussel before. <laughs> Making me look an idiot today. It's a really nice roach. Absolute stunner over a pound roach, gorgeous. Get it back quick. No massive head of tench today, and carp was reasonably small, but a couple of tench. Um, but yeah, it's been enjoyable. At least I've had fish because most other people around the lake are suffering, struggling today, so I'm quite pleased with that. Crucians, decent roach, perch, chub. Tench, carp. And now it's starting to rain, so I think I might head off. Thanks very much for watching. I hope you like and subscribe, and hopefully, I'll meet you down on the lake somewhere sometime. Good time to leave. I had a couple more crucian before I uh, finish packing up, um, but every peg's now taken, including the one I've just left. Someone stepped straight in. In fact, there were two people wanting it. So, yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. Tight lines.